The touch of yours is what I've been looking for. I'm going to Ibadan, guys. I've never been to Ibadan before. I think I've been to all the all the western states apart from Ibadan, apart from Oyo State. I was born in Lagos, grew up in Lagos, raised in Lagos, lived in Lagos. I've been to Ogun and just a bunch of other states, but I've never been to Oyo State. So this is <laughs> this is my first time of going to Oyo State. So. Um, yeah, I'm going to Ibadan for I can't even mention what I'm going for here because because I can't, okay? I can't mention what I'm going to Ibadan for, but I'm actually going to I'm actually going to Ibadan for the weekend. If I like, I'll bring you guys along, I'm not sure, but um, yeah. So I boarded a train. The Lagos to Ibadan train. This is my ticket. It's a business class ticket. I wanted to board the first class ticket, honestly, but then I came. <laughs> I came late in my usual fashion, so I had to stay in business class, kind of. So I'll try to show you guys along, show you guys what it looks like. But it really looks, it looks really good. It looks really good. So I'll try to show you guys what it looks like. I'm in my laptop. I think I want to. I want to just start working because I've been slacking. I've been slacking with regards to work. Before I get fired, <laughs> before I get fired, so I've been slacking. So I need to get to work. But I'm just going to show you guys what it looks like. So how it works is that you go to the train station at Ebute Meta to buy your ticket. You can buy a first class ticket, a business class ticket, or an economy class ticket. First class costs six k business class 5k which is the one that i bought and economy is around maybe 25 to 35 i don't really know the range but you also need to know the time but i know that the train leaves the lagos train station by 6 p.m every weekday first train on the plane we were flying to the mountain all across the ocean and there we go again Walking in the streets, lost in new places, a million new faces, diving deeper in the world, riding on the road into the unknown, on our own until we settle down, warming our hearts, finding new bones, trying to find a place we call.
at Abiyokuta. So that's why this coach is empty because people actually stopped at Abiyokuta. So we are heading to Ibadan right now. It's kind of scanty because people stopped over at Abiyokuta we're finally at Ibadan we're finally at Ibadan so there are a couple of taxis waiting somewhere close to this train station and all that but we're finally at Ibadan it was an amazing ride it was an amazing ride I totally recommend so let's just see what I got up to at Ibadan you can tell that this hotel is everything it's everything it's called owo crown hotel and it's located at iwo road and it's it's quite affordable i mean it's 25k per night or more. i don't know it's maybe from 25 to 30k per night i don't really know how much it costs i'm so sorry and i want to know but it's cost around 25 to 30k per night it has a swimming pool it has a gym it has like rooms that look really good it has an elevator but elevator is not like a wow factor of any place but it's a really cool place i like it i feel that it's it's money well spent <sighs> okay <laughs> I, if you know you know i feel that it's money well spent i feel that it's money well spent so if you are in ibadan this is not a sponsored video it is not a sponsored video but if you're in ibadan and you are looking for a cozy place to stay you can check out Owo crown hotel it's affordable they have good customer service good food good everything okay even when you feel low you can still go even when you feel slow you can still go even when there's no hope you can still go i never answered a no man i still go 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 Hustle every single day I'll be making moves till I'm buried in my grave uh, To the system, I don't wanna be a slave I've been doing shit my way uh, Or the highway And in the driveway is a nice thing Hey guys, I'm
guys i want you guys to know that i'm a picky eater i don't eat so many things and i'm always scared of trying new food so for this food i had high expectations but the amala was so sticky so maybe it's because of where i got the food from now i'm back to lagos so if you know any good amala please i'm willing to give this a second chance if you know any good amala place in lagos please let me know so that i can go and buy amala from there Guys, so that's the end of this. That's the end of this journey forever. <laughs> you see me eating ego um, it not ego soup, please, please. Not ego soup slander to be tolerated. You see me eating a red one. Is it a red one? A red one, right? A red one and a mala. Beat me. <laughs> Beat me, please, because I'm so good at home. It's, it's not like it's not nice, but I was just, I had high expectations. I wanted it to blow my mind the way it would end. It was just super, it blew my mind for, for like two decades now. But this was so basic. I'm going to subscribe to my YouTube channel. <laughs> I'm only on Instagram and I have to see. So I come here with you next time to be nice to your neighbors and um, you've eaten a veggie soup that, and you, you like it. I know you. So I'm not going to stop here. I'm like, I'm now. But it's just a super heavy drink all day.